Global Command and Control System GCCS is the United States Armed Forces DOD Joint Command and Control C2 system used to provide accurate, complete, and timely information for the operational chain of command for U.S. Armed Forces. GCCS is most often used to refer to the computer system, but actually consists of hardware, software, common procedures, standards, and numerous applications and interfaces that make up an operational architecture that provides worldwide connectivity with all levels of command. GCCS incorporates systems that provide situational awareness, support for intelligence, force planning, readiness assessment, and deployment applications that battlefield commanders require to effectively plan and execute joint military operations. History GCCS evolved from earlier predecessors such as TBMCS Theater Battle Management Core Systems, Joint Operations Tactical System JOTS, and Joint Maritime Command Information System JMCIS to fulfill a requirement for technological, procedural, and security improvements to the aging Worldwide Military Command and Control System, aka WWMCCS, and its Tempest requirements requirements of Cold War defense from wire tapping and electromagnetic signal interceptions, to include physical special wire and cabinet shielding, double locks and operational special access passes and passwords measures. On August 30, 1996, the Defense Information Systems Agency DISA officially decommissioned WWMCCS and the Joint Staff declared the Global Command and Control System GCCS as the Joint Command and Control System of Record. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Applications, Functionality. GCCS systems comprise various data processing and web services which are used by many applications supporting combat operations, troop, force movements jokes, intelligence analysis and production, targeting, ground weapons and radar analysis, and terrain and weather analysis. Some next-generation applications designed for GCCS may support collaboration using chat systems, newsgroups and email. See JOPES, MOB, ODI, etc. GCCS supports six mission areas operations, mobilization, deployment, employment, sustainment, and intelligence through eight functional areas, threat identification and assessment, strategy planning aids, course of action development, execution planning, implementation, monitoring, risk analysis, and a common tactical picture. Topic. Connectivity GCCS may use NIPNE, SIPNE, JWICS, or other IP-based networks for connectivity. In some installations, GCCS aggregates over 94 different sources of data. Topic. Components, variants GCCS Army GCCS AF Air Force GCCS I Intelligence GCCS J Marine Corps, Joint Forces GCCS M Maritime Navy Coast Guard The Navy's life cycle development of what is currently referred to as the Global Command and Control System was and continues to be evolutionary in nature and will probably never result in a permanent system. 
From the early 1980s when SPAWAR's PD-40VADM Jerry O. Tuttle's Joint Operations Tactical System was the premier system, through the tenure of VADM John Gauss's Joint Maritime Command Information System JMCIS, the final product would be realized as the Global Command and Control System GCCS, introduced conceptually by the Defense Intelligence Support Agency DISA. Topic. See also Worldwide Military Command and Control System